Welcome to the Isodrone's 360-degree interactive field site. Costa Rica. We are above a piece of forest that has been designated by the government as a national park for dry forest research. Our experimental site was nested into three levels of detail for our investigations. Now let's touch down and take a closer look at the research site. Welcome to the jungle. As you can see, this is no ordinary jungle. In months of work, we have built the casita, the small hut in front of which we are standing, set up monitoring plots, climbed trees, installed solar panels and cables, and equipped trees with sensors for long-term data logging. All cables lead to the casita. The casita will serve as our orientation point for the following tour. You will have the opportunity to move around more or less freely and take a closer look at different areas. Hi everyone! At study site, we focus our research on two main tree species, caoba and tempisque, two extremely valuable and endangered dry forest tree species. Within a broad variety of tree species, there are two big categories of behaviors. Those that regularly lose their leaves, they are called deciduous. And those that have green leaves throughout the year, independent of the season, are called evergreens. If you look at the canopy of the caoba tree, you can see that only a few leaves are left. In comparison, the tempisca trees that you can see on the other side of the casita show a different behavior. Here, three to five individuals of this species are equipped with measuring devices for recording continuous data on how the tree uses water. Let's look at some actual data recorded during our first field campaign in 2019. At the top, you see the water input. In orange, our irrigation events, and in blue, the first natural precipitation events at the onset of the rainy season. It's a heat pulse velocity sensor, has three needles. I'm on the water tower right now, here on our study site in Costa Rica. Directly behind the casita, we have excavated a soil profile to be able to monitor soil moisture and soil water isotopes at different depths. And the individual right in front of you is the biggest we are monitoring, T1. Look to the sky to observe how different the canopy is under the lush green crowns of Tempisque in comparison to the trees on the caoba plot. The data you see here shows the reaction of the investigated Tempisque trees to our artificial irrigation and to the following onset of the rainy season back in 2019. Are you ready for a spectacular view and you have the courage for our 360 degree overflight? Here you have the opportunity to hop on our UAV and experience a bird's eye view of our study site. Enjoy the flight!